When we first wrote our test, we used a promise style callback using then functions in order to run code after specific commands. With WebDriver 4.0, they introduce a new style of coding that makes it a bit easier to understand the order in which commands are being executed. This is called sync mode, and we briefly covered it when we reviewed the WebDriver IO configuration file. In this video, we'll update our tests to match this new style and see how it can improve the readability of our tests. The first change we need to make is to turn sync mode on. To do that, we go to our configuration file, find the sync setting, and set it to true. Now we go back to our test file and make two sets of changes. The first is a simple update, which is to delete the return keyword. Since the test is now synchronous, Mocha doesn't need to know about the promise on the browser object. The second change is slightly more complicated. Instead of using then function callbacks, we will treat the get title and get URL commands as if they were synchronous actions. To get started, let's isolate this first get title call. We separate it from the surrounding commands, then convert this to a simple variable assignment. This removes the need for the then function, so we can get rid of it. We keep the console log though, as the code we want to run immediately after the get title command remains the same. Let's do the same for our second get title call. Again, isolate the command, assign the result to a variable, and remove the then function. We do need to update the console log to match the updated variable, as we created a new variable name to avoid confusion with the previous get title variable assignment. Finally, we'll update the get URL command following the same pattern. Let's save our file and run our test. As expected, everything works in our new synchronous format. I personally enjoy this style over the original promise style commands. It makes the code more concise, easier to read, and gets rid of the boilerplate of having to write then functions all the time. The style is only available via the test runner though, as behind the scenes, it adds the proper Mocha hooks needed to execute in this manner. Going forward, we'll be using this format for all of our testing.